here is an example of rod control. So in this rod control, we have got a length of a rod 1, 2, 3, 4 and the respective prices 2, 5, 7 and 8. So this uh, rod length of 1 will be sold with the price of 2 whereas a rod length of 2 will be sold with the price of 5. So we are going to find the best output of this particular rod selling. So when we want to have a rod with the length, these are length and these are the profits that we can achieve, we will arrange this in a tabular form so to find out the best output. Rod length of 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 are the possible ways with which we can sell the rod in the market. So if this is a rod with the length 0, then we will not achieve anything because there is no rod exists. So in all the situation, we will get a 0 as output. So if we have a rod of length 1 and the possibility is this only, 1. So if we sell a rod of length 1 in the market, the price of that is 2. So we will achieve a maximum price of 2. So if we have a rod of length 1, length 2 and we have option to sell the rod of length 1, then the rod of length 2 will be cut in two parts, each with a length 1 and we will achieve a price of 2. So 2 into 2, we will get a 4 maximum profit with this particular rod of length 2. So if we have a rod of length 3 and the possibility of selling the rod of length 1 only so we'll get a price of length maximum profit is 6 if we have a rod of length 4 then the possibility is to sell it in the market is rod of length 1 so 4 is divided in one part so four parts we can achieve and the maximum profit we can gain is 8 so then we have a rod of length say Two. We have two possibilities now. We can sell a rod of length 1 and rod of length 2. So if we sell a rod of length 2, we will get a 5 as a maximum profit. So what we do is, we have a rod of length 1 to be sold in the market. So there is no possibility. So 2 will be continued because we have only one option. Now we have a rod of length 2. So rod of length 2 either can be cut in two parts 1 and 1 and sold in for 4 or a rod of length 2 can be sold for 5 rupees. So 5 is a better option than 4. So we will go with this 5 as an option. We have a rod of length 3 and two options are exist. So what we do is we will get a maximum if we sell a rod of length 2 and then we'll get a 5 and rod of length 1 will be sold for 2 rupees and then 5 plus 2 that is 7 is the achievement. So if we sell a rod of length 4, if we want to sell a rod of length 4 and the possibility are to either sell a rod of length 1 and 4. Already we have sold by cutting a rod of length 1 in 4 parts and achieved the maximum profit as 8 but we have a possibility second option available so with this we can cut this part into 2 and get a maximum profit as a 10 so 10 is a better option than 8 so we will go with this now now we have three options available length 1 2 3 and the possible profits 2 5 7 so if we have a rod of length 1 then we will continue with the same because we have no other option by selling a rod of length 1 in the market. So if we have a rod of length 2, then the possible out of these possible options, so we will go with the previous option that is 5 because that is the best achievement that we can get. So if we have a rod of length 3, so what we can do is either we will go the, with the previous option, the maximum profit we have achieved is 7 and IR just sell a rod of length 3 in the market and achieve 7. So 7 by selling a rod of length 3 is the same that we have achieved by cutting a rod of length 2 and 1. 
so we will continue with the same then we have got a rod of length 4 so selling a rod of length 4 has in these three options what we can do cut a rod of length 2 into 2 that we have achieved is 10 10 but cutting a rod of length 3 and rod of length 1 that is 9 so 10 is a better option so we will continue with the same now we have got four options available to sell it in the market rod of length 1 2 3 and 4 whereas if we have a rod of length 1 we will continue with the same by 2 if we have a rod of length 2 then we will continue with the same because we have the best option already achieved that is 5 so if we have rod of length 3 we will go with the same because this is the best option that we have achieved but if we have rod of length 4 we can sell it by 8 directly or we will continue with the same that we have achieved is 10 so what we can get is a 10 is the best option available so 10 is the maximum profit the profit is equal to 10 but how have we achieved this particular profit so 10 is the best option but how did we get this 10 is collected from the previous location this and this so this is what the 2 is 2 is the best option by which we have cut the rod of length 2 so this is what we have 2 is the rod cut that we have achieved but this rod cut is collected from 1 and 2 so this is the major change that we can get that is also achieved from 2 so 2 into 2 is the best option that we can get for a rod of length 2 so 2 into 2 that is 5 plus 5 is 10 this is the maximum profit that we can get so this is what the best profit and these are the location with which we can find the memorization of the rod from where we have collected this 2 and 2 thank you